<laughs> All right, Super Collider on Android. Here's what we've got so far. So this is just a, a simple activity on Android made using the Super Collider server. Just a simple synth that's controlled, you know, with the finger gestures, changing the pitch and amplitude. So that's just a very simple kind of default activity that I've created. Um, but the nice thing is that we can connect to it over the Wi-Fi and actually control it from the laptop so we can do quite a variety of things with it. So now I've created the, uh, the little GUI for the server here and if I list the nodes on the server we've got this one um, default synth which is the one that, that you heard being played I can control it remotely. Cool, and we can stop it. So then we can send um, different synthesizers that we want to define on the laptop and just send them over. Mm -hmm. uh, or we can define a synth that we can play a pattern with. So let's try something sort of with an envelope like. Beautiful, right, okay, so another thing you can do is use um, Super Collider's machine listening capabilities. So what I'm going to do is um, I'm going to define a synth that's going to play on this and also a synth that's going to do some analysis on the sound. So this is the, sound, the one that makes the sound. And we're going to analyse the uh, the spectral centroid of that whooshing sound, and it's going to be analysed on here. But then we're going to read it back on here. Let's try it. So, yeah. Fantastic.